Hello there. Uh, so this is part four of our uh, tutorial, and uh, let's uh, start working with the risings. Uh, for those, uh, let's uh, just um, add a new material. And you can see there is random colors as well, so we just need uh, to select, we can just select this setup here. Uh, that produces the random colors and uh, paste that and we can use that as our base color and uh, we don't even need this screen uh, this mix blending mode here so we can remove that so we have different colors here we don't have a green color but have a dark one like that then we have then we have this almost yellow then we have what uh, that tradition so uh, we need to turn on subsurf for this make sure I'm saving so this will also be fed into the color Can we go more than, two? let's see, can we do 10? Yeah. Maybe 20. I'm not sure if this is the right way to do it, but I think I'm getting good results, so I'll just do it that way. Risings. Uh, the roughness should be not uh, that extreme. <clears throat> I guess we can also use the texture we use for the displacement. Uh, texture, image, texture, and uh, bring this cloth. Mm, is this this one? Yeah, this here. And then we can use that as our displacement. Maybe reduce uh, the amount using the math node. <coughs> Change the operation to multiply. Now we can use point, point one. So we do need some really dark risings here, so I think we need this to be around 10 or 5. Let's see, let's see, one, yeah, I think one, maybe not even one point, something like point five. 
so this shouldn't be yellow uh, the yellow ones should be less I think this is too rounded so we can come in select a path like this turn on proportional So for the oh, for this here, uh, we just need a noise texture. Something that uh, maybe this can work. I don't know. Let's see this. Maybe this grass here. So this soil, and I will just use that. Uh, first, it it needs also to have uh, that sub surf. So if we give it a value of one, and uh, for the color. Now we just need a texture to display it. Also the refraction, the roughness should be smaller. See, I think that's good, but uh, we need more displacement. Add Converter. Let's try a value of one, two, one. Okay. I will just need to increase the size, so we need to add some mapping and scale this up. Let's try five by five by five. Okay, maybe point one. Point one. Then point one. Now this we can leave this at one on one. And uh, just under the modifier, uh, we can increase uh, the subdivisions here, and maybe give our texture here more strength. You can also just come in and start pushing some of these vertices up because uh, without the displacement, everything is, the plane is flat. So uh, we can select, then turn on random here, proportion editing. I can also come to this and uh, increase the depth. Uh, this will give uh, the texture more details. Let's try increasing the scale here and see. And uh, maybe also increase on the contrast.
It's not as detailed as that, but uh, I guess that we can try out a different text and see if we use this and see. let's try this and see. So I'll just drop this here. And I guess we can add a color ramp to bring in that contrast. Maybe even mix these two here, color. So we can use another color ramp here for this. So these will be small details and these will be larger details. And I use a color mix RGB to mix these two. Just need to set this to multiply or screen. that would be maybe we can reduce the subsurf a bit And uh, what we need to do is add a light radius volume for indirect lighting to uh, calculate indirect lighting and uh, also a reflection cube. Scale this up. Now this is supposed to be multiply, not add. And we also reduce the contrast here to something like point 0.2. can bake other indelict lighting and see. Now we can also add a background image for the lighting. again
Now we can turn on camera bra. Lens blur. Heaps of field. And uh, select the camera. And uh, in the depth, we can select one of those as our focus focus object and uh, set the f-stops to 0.1. Maybe that's too much around there. So let's try increasing the light here and see 50. So let's see if we change to cycles. So I'll render this out and uh, see how it comes out and I'll post it for you to see. Thank you.